In this video, we will show you how to do an oil change on this 2009 Dodge Dakota with a 4.7 liter engine. You're going to need your oil filter and six quarts of 5W20 oil. Let's get into it. Okay friends, let's get started on our oil change. Make your way over to the oil cap and remove it. Along the top, it tells you exactly what type of oil to use. We'll give this a quick inspection and set it aside. Make your way to the oil dipstick. Take hold of that, give it a little twist, and remove it from the dipstick tube. Once you've done that, bring it over to a clean rag and wipe it off. That way there you can inspect what your oil looks like before you replace it. Now we can put this back in, leaving it out. Now we can make our way underneath the vehicle. Now let's make our way underneath the vehicle. We're going to locate the engine oil drain plug. You'll find just underneath it, you have this cross member. As we start pulling this out of here, keep in mind, the engine oil will be splashing off of this. Make sure you have hand and eye protection and a collection bucket under the area. We'll use a 13 millimeter to remove this drain plug. Once that's draining, we'll go ahead and put in the drain plug, snug it up, and torque it to 25 foot-pounds. Let's clean the area. Now we can make our way back up top. Now we can move along to replacing our oil filter. Make sure you have your collection bucket under this area. Now we can prime our new oil filter by putting some new oil in through the center here and then coating along the gasket. Wipe down the engine, make sure there's no existing gasket, install your new oil filter. Once you have your oil filter bottomed out, just give it a little bit extra just to make sure that it's completely secured. Clean your mess. Let's start adding oil. Now that we've added our oil, remove the funnel, install your oil cap, reinstall the dipstick, start the engine. Remove the dipstick, give it a quick wipe, and recheck the oil level. What we're looking for here is to make sure we're in the middle of the hatched area. Now when we're looking for this, we're looking for the hatched area. You want to be directly in the center of it. Anything below it, you need to add a little bit, and if you're above, drain some out. This looks perfect. I'll reinstall the dipstick. Okay friends, we showed you how to do your oil change on your vehicle. At this point, go ahead and close the hood and take your vehicle for a road test. Thanks for watching. When only the best will do, demand TRQ. The only company that lets you view before you do. TRQ is committed to offering the highest quality aftermarket auto parts that are engineered for peace of mind. Thanks for using and viewing with TRQ.